Hey guys, it's Kid Chris 14 and we are here at the House of Frankenstein again because we're here in Lake George because of car show and we still have time so I figured why not stop having a look. So here we go. Alright guys, we're in. Oh what? Looks like a few of these are off. Oh never mind. This one don't know why he's not moving. That's strange. Yeah, third time. Take off my mask. Can't breathe. There we go. That's better. Alright. Alright, let's do this. Alright, guys. Here we go. Also, while I'm here, I'm gonna see if I can film for a new House of Frankenstein commercial I'll be creating soon. There's one scene I cannot use already. Now, let me stand right here for a second. Catch a little bit here, real quick. Catch that real quick for this. Perfect. All right. Here's, here we go. Welcome. My friends have been dying to meet you. Body snatchers, Burke and hair grave robbers. If you could just see it. Yeah. Yeah. is Frankenstein. Go. Alright. It is rather very unsettlingly dark in here. Alright. Ram Stoker's Dracula. Here we go. And there is C turned into a bat. <laughs> and this is Death of a Vampire. When stake in the heart. Well, here is Treasure Island. I love the little net effect that's right there. The floor is actually really creaking under me. It's making me feel a bit unsafe, but whatever. Here is the amazing room of rats. Pets for some people. Oh, I'm gonna incline a little bit. The Lost Jungle. Use handrail. Expect the unexpected. Is this guy. Where's the handrail? I have. I have held onto the handrail. And oh, Here's your I don't know what that is. And right here, creature from the Black Lagoon. All right. Continuing on. There is the predator. Then this right here is this right here is the zombie. Some strange sound. Back into the dead to join the rest. That's cool. 
This here is a strange case of Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. I don't know if I can't seem to focus. There it is. This is the undead. People buried alive. Can't happen again. <laughs> this is the Grim Reaper. With the dawn comes death. This is, right here, this is the bathtub murder. This right here is the Attic Ghost. <sighs> this is the werewolf. According to legend, during the full moon, some unfortunate humans turn to wolves to kill until dawn. Like Chewbacca. <laughs> That's really what I said last time. This is the wax workshop. Keep friends of mine souvenirs. Because why not? This is the mummy's revenge right here. That is pretty spooky. Wow. This place it looks very rather unsettling in there. I don't know why. Just gives me a very. Oh! <laughs> okay, wow. Wow. Very uncalled for. Alright. This is. Seance. Oh my god, my heart's pounding. Right. The little flame out of the open one mansion. That's funny. Alright, this is the crypt. People are here when not Seance. Pretty creepy in a good way. This is Pit and Pendulum, a post story of Spanish Inquisition. If I said that correctly. This is Notre Dame of Paris, Esmeralda rescued by Quasimodo. Here is the Phantom of the Opera. Very spooky, I love it. Alright, then we continue on down this hallway. And glass right here. This is the tourist trap. I know what happens. Maybe if I let me try. Okay, maybe brightness can kinda of tell. Anyways, here we go. The tourist trap. Wait for it. There it is! Hello. But that kinda of got me, but not as bad as the other one. This is Jack the Ripper. This music is so unsettling. The price of infidelity. Your housemate can end up in the same circumstances. Turn up the brightness. 
say that I'm bad. The disease had sharpened my senses, not destroyed, not dulled them. Above all was the sense of hearing. Here's Edgar Allan Poe, a master of mystery. Say how first the idea had in my mind. Eh. Catch in here. Then this is Freddy versus Jason, but with a twist. <laughs> Almost got, kind of got me that time, but not as much as last time. Last time I screamed like so loud. It was so funny. But anyways, continuing on. But here we have. The Druids, human sacrifice upon the altar. Very creepy background music. Looks like that's supposed to be exhibit, but it's closed. This is the 17th century witch trials. So let me get a focus. Where is it? I heard it again. And here we go. Scenes up there. Oh, this one's not lighting up, but this is Peg on my heart. This is the Mad Mortician's Experiments. This is Bastille Death, the Garot. This is Canada's first hangman. in the electric chair. Wait for it. Justice will be served. I'm oh, sorry, let me just get to see the focus real quick. There we go. Right, here we go, he's doing the switch. Here we go. Seventeenth century beheading. You see over there sharpening the axe, and he's like, "Why am I do? Why are you doing this to me again?" <laughs> this is the forgotten prisoner. Lonely, lonely, lonely. Here we go. Here we go. Bed of nails. 
stones were piled upon the victim, doing, driving his weight into the nails. Ow. Alright, now here we are. Off to the torture chambers. Alright. Here we are. He's about to hit this man with a hammer. This guy's in stocks. He is trapped in a rat cage. Uh, or there's somebody stuck in hat, whatever it's called. This man's stuck in here. I, have, I don't even want to know what's going on over there. And then, this is an Iron Maiden. Cross the wheels, jam right in. Owie. Alright. We have all these bells right here. And then, wait, this is Count Delurge. Last time I was in here, I actually missed this. Don't wanna know how I did. This is the rack. These, um, um, touching very hot. And then here is guillotine. Used in France for execution. Here we go on this one. Play is going up very slowly. Going up, and 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 up, up, and up, and up, guys are just poking them. That guy's up on a hook, ow. And this guy is stuck to a spinning turntable. Oh, jeez. Alright. Next up is the black hole. Where's the spins I've been showing me to? Okay, sorry for the British accent. <laughs> yeah, a lot of strobe in here. Hello, everyone. Yeah, hold me on maze. Hello. Just hold on to the railings here. Got it. Have this full black bowl. I love these things. Woo! It's so much fun going through this thing. I could do this all day as long as I don't get sick like I did at Six Flags Great Adventure. Oh boy. I know, right? It's unsettling in a good way. Yeah, it would make me sick in half a second. Why did they let y'all have I don't know what that's all about, but that's all good. Maybe I go through this here. We just gotta go over here. Go on back through here. And that's it. And that's it. Alright, let me look at some more features in here real quick. Go. You guys enjoyed the video.